at the Lawrence Livermore Laboratory in California. The nuclear tests of the past can be seen to this very day. Every test conducted by the U.S. was filmed and stored as top secret archives. Nuclear physicist Greg Spriggs and film technician Jim Moy want to change this. Declassifying the valuable films is one part of their job. All of the films that we have declassified will be posted on our uh, Livermore YouTube site so that people can see the films and can see what, what we're seeing. The explosions were documented and in surprising detail considering the technical capabilities of film production at the time. Jim Moy has already digitized more than 4,000 reels from over 210 nuclear tests. I mean, they recorded a lot. I don't know how they could even have foreseen how this would be used in the future. Once the images are digitized, Greg Spriggs' work begins. Information on the recordings, like the distance between the camera and the detonation center, or the size of the bomb, provide a great deal of insight into the state of research back then. The two times nuclear bombs were used against people date back more than 70 years. But the ensuing ethical discussion is still relevant to this very day.